It's time for you to review and take action on the employ proof of investment submissions. The pending for review tab displays the list of employees who have submitted their proof of investment for review. Review and consider each item submitted by an employee and take appropriate action. Filter employees as per the regime list and select a regime per your requirements. You can filter employees based on employment status using the active or resigned button. Select active to view the current employees. Select resigned to view the separated employees for the current financial year. Select the individual details option and search for the employee for whom you want to review the proof of investment form. Under the view form tab, click view form. The page displays the items that the employee has declared. Click here to go to a particular proof of investment component. You can then view all the details and attachments of the selected proof of investment component. You can consider, accept, reject or even re-release individual items in an employee's proof of investment form. Please note, if you want to collect additional documents apart from their proof of investments, get in touch with our support team to enable the option. Click here to view family details. The family details pop-up appears. You can refer to and add employees family members if required. Click approve or reject. Accept or reject pop-up appears. In the admin remarks text box, enter the remarks. It is crucial to add comments, especially when rejecting a declaration. This helps the employee to rectify and resubmit the form. Click yes to approve the proof of investment component. Similarly, follow the same procedure to review all the components. Click review and consider. Click consider proof of investment and confirm. The proof of investment form moves to the pending for payroll tab. While reviewing an employee's proof of investment form, there can be items that may need to comply with the guidelines and you want to reject them. In such cases, you can re-release those items to the employee from the re-release tab. Click re-release selected to release the selected items to the employees for resubmission. Click here to go back to the proof of investment overview page. With that, we come to an end. Thank you for watching the great HR how-to video series.